to me, Estora is like the home of badminton. Uh, I've seen, uh, I had used to have this DVD from the Thomas Cup finals back in, I think, 2002, when Denmark lost the final to China. And they've done it. Chinese players rush on to court. The Danes dejected. And China have won back the Thomas Cup after 14 years since they last lifted the trophy. The men's doubles pairing confirmation there of the score for Sang Yang and Cheng Bo. 15-13, 15-8. I used to watch that DVD a hundred times uh, and dreaming about playing in this arena. Um, it's just so special, it has so much history. And every time I've come here, it's just completely lived up to the hype and the expectations. Um, yeah, so that the atmosphere is like none other place in the world. I honestly don't think the fans has changed. Well, what has impressed me is that they haven't changed, actually. It's been as extraordinary every single time. When I came here the first time to play in 2008, I was literally a nobody in this world. Uh, I even lost in the qualifying, and I still felt this yeah, the same kind of support. Of course, there's a few more that's shouting now that I'm more known, uh, but you still feel the same kind of uh, like passion for the sport and passion for every single player. Just looking for a good movement and a, and a big smash. <laughs> Four. Oh, you got to love it, haven't you? Don't hit me in the face next time, opponent. <laughs> Played in great spirit. It's just amazing every single time, and you really need to experience it to really understand how crazy it is. I think. So the Bali boys, it's uh, a fun story from uh, when we played the uh, Indonesia Open and Indonesia Masters in Bali. Um, there was this. Uh, festival night before the tournament started and me and Antonsen, Skorup and Astrup dressed up in uh, traditional Balinese clothing. Uh, yeah, posed for a photo and just, it was to try and pay some uh, respect to uh, to the culture of uh, yeah the Balinese people and the Indonesian people in general and to show that we appreciated being there, uh, appreciated their culture. And uh, yeah, of course that picture blew up on the social media and got very popular and the, uh, the nickname Bali Boys has uh, stuck with us ever since and uh, yeah I just love that I even uh, I like to look at that photo every now and then I also shared it again before this trip but uh, it's a very nice memory from Indonesia for me. no 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 it was from the fans it was from the fans as soon as they saw that photo it was just uh, yeah Bali Boys yeah. So. yeah it was it was it was a very good trip very good trip